Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to assess how fast a Star Stable horse can actually run. So first off, there's going to be a lot of math in this video. So if you don't care about the math, you just want to know the speed, go ahead and skip to about 3 minutes and 45 seconds, and we have the speeds in miles per hour and kilometers per hour. And on that, speed is generally given in miles per hour or in kilometers per hour. We're going to be calculating it mainly in miles per hour, and at the end we'll show it in both. Distance, we're going to find it in feet and then convert it to miles, and time in seconds, convert it to hours, just to get the speed in miles per hour. First, we're going to start by measuring the distance of a specified area that we want to time the running for. So since you can't uh, put a ruler into Star Stable, obviously, we're going to have to measure this by using the average stride length of a woman, which is 2.2 feet. So we're, a stride length is from heel to heel each time her foot comes down in a walking stride. So we're going to take that 2.2 feet times how many of our strides it takes to cover this area. So to count the strides, we've slowed the original clip down to half its speed. And we started at the corner right at that first post and went to the where the gap is so you could tell easily where to start and stop the time. So as you can see, it took 17 strides and each stride is 2.2 feet. So you just multiply 17 by 2.2 and you get 37.4 feet as the total distance. In one of our past videos, we calculated that our girl is five feet tall around that we use the height of the horses in the game um, we'll leave a link to that video in the description in case you're interested but we're going to use her five feet height which is equal to this bar here and see how many bars can fit this fence just to see if our stride measurement is close and just kind of check ourselves so as you can see here the uh, fence is about six with this little bit of extra room that i'm going to say is about one fifth of a bar so that would be just one more foot so if you add that all together, you have the distance is 31 feet. So as you can see, they're both slightly different, 37.4 and 31. So we just wanted to average those two together and you just add them together, divide by two and get 34.2 feet. And that's what we used for this first trial. We're gonna run two trials here for the time it takes for the horse to run this distance, just to try to have the most accurate results that we can. As you can see, they're both about one second, just a little over. So we can tell that it's pretty accurate. So we're gonna put our distance over our time. In this case, it's the 34.2 feet over the 1.045 seconds, which is 32.7 feet per second. Now you're gonna convert that to miles per hour, and that's 23.3 miles per hour. We're gonna look at this uh, speed over a greater distance to see if this result remains constant. So this clip is sped up four times the original speed just because it's so long, because this is across the entire bridge between the Wolf in and Moreland so it's quite a distance and I followed the exact same process as before except over a longer distance so it's 225 strides here across the bridge. Like in the previous trials we ran a horse across the same distance and the same maxed horse is the same one as we used previously and it took 11.14 seconds. So it was 495 feet in 11.14 seconds which is 44 0.4 feet per second we converted it to miles per hour and it's 30.34 miles per hour and this is slightly higher than the previous test however this is probably due to the fact that we can't measure the bridge based on the girl's height since it's just so long so in the first trial we got 23.3 miles per hour and in the second trial we got 30 miles per hour so we did the same thing we did with the distance we averaged them together adding the both the totals up dividing by two to get the average speed of a horse. This is 26.82 miles per hour or 43.18 kilometers per hour. The average horse travels around 25 to 30 miles per hour galloping, so that fits with the Star Stable horse. Like always, thanks for watching. We appreciate feedback. If you have any questions that aren't answered in the description, ask below in the comments.